Hey folks, uh, so this video is pretty much uh, in a, a changelog video of Open Studio Chat App, where a Chat App is uh, just uh, one component of uh, Open Studio's ecosystem. So just uh, what uh, new additions are added uh, to Open Studio Chat App. Uh, so just a couple of new providers were integrated: uh, the XAI models like Grok2, Grok2 Vision and then perplexities models, sonar, uh, sonar pro reasoning uh, models and then um, the pro version um, not much uh, of the changes but just uh, a paywall is added into the system uh, so basically uh, like as of now uh, so what are the tires that are here so since uh, I have uh, I'm already a premium user of this platform so uh, just a free tire w what is it that you're going to get uh, it's just uh, of course uh, mm, two uh, assistants that is side by side uh, the messages comparisons against the models of your choice and then uh, the uh, the restriction layer which I have added is just yeah or you can uh, uh, converse uh, with just hundred messages per month and then if you wanted to uh, use the other models apart from chart up default uh, model so you need to bring your own api keys and that's the free tire and uh, pro tire so uh, the side by side assistants are going to uh, uh, is going to stay the same i try to uh, extend that to four assistants but i was not satisfied uh, it still sucks <laughs> what does that mean uh, so basically uh, uh, whatever is here it's not on the screen that you're seeing so uh, still a lot of issues box uh, because uh, the user uh, journeys around uh, selecting assistants uh, is a bit trickier like for uh, the uh, existent existing sessions or new sessions or if a uh, new session is trying to change uh, the models frequently from the uh, about provider selector or if it's a uh, uh, historical uh, charts then again uh, if we are conversed with let's say model 1 model 2 and it's trying to change the model and try to converse it so just uh, their state management for uh, assistant selection uh, it's, it's a bit confusing for me so I'll, I'll not add it uh, that layer so it's uh, it's it's still not a pushed and that's uh, the thing so that's that's why I'm just restricting uh, for now for uh, two uh, side by side assistants and then here the number of messages limit per month it's going to be way higher 500 messages and then you don't have to bring any api key for all of the models that are part of this open studios uh, chat up and then uh, so if uh, new features are going to be released for example currently a lot of work is going on and a lot of pipeline uh, features uh, one of that uh, like uh, deep research and all like many other things so if I'm releasing that so you will get an, uh, uh, the uh, well in advance access to new features uh, that's one thing and then priority support it's going to be there so if, if, uh, if you are facing some issue or uh, if you we, I'm just uh, we are just a, a message away a DM away so we are going to prioritize your issue and then support that and then one more uh, tire a lifetime access so basically this is going to be very limited time uh, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty much uh, uh, very honest here so there's not much of a value being provided from this platform open studios chart up uh, as of now but still uh, if you are the one who is willing to uh, buy this uh, for lifetime so you are going to get an access to existing features whatever all of them and then uh, uh, we, whatever we are going to develop in coming days all we are going to give you an access without any additional pay so this is going to be very limited uh, uh, time offer so it's just for the people who are uh, really wanted to uh, see this platform go somewhere and uh, so likewise you see uh, you're going to see uh, all of the things that we are going to offer in a free and pro tire and then unlimited messages of course you can just converse uh, uh, without any limitations and then 
uh, like uh, one more uh, dedicated so for example if you need a dedicated feature exclusive for your needs we are going to build that for you alone so we are not going to grant anyone access to that so that's one uh, advantage if you are going to go for lifetime access really looking forward to you uh, to be part of this open studios uh, ecosystem so these are the uh, layers uh, just i have added and so basically uh, there you can just buy it for monthly or annually uh, so just 20 percent off on annual so just uh, it will be eight bucks per month and if you're buying monthly so it'll be, it'll be just uh, 10 bucks per month and that's the thing uh, for now so um, like i said uh, uh, if you are uh, not on pro tire we are restricting number of messages basically number of queries you can ask uh, on this platform and all so since i'm on pro tire i'll be uh, uh, having an access to much higher limits so let's say now i'm just going to uh, remove my pro access so let me just do that uh, i'm just removing uh, my pro access and let me just uh, refresh this so it's just loading and and, and there are like uh, we are going to uh, talk through like what has been added into the system and all just a way and all those things so it's it's going to be just pretty much exciting and uh yeah uh fine so now you can see all right so just like i said uh assistant selection still uh agree there are bugs and issues but for most of the scenarios it should work pretty much fine so now you see i just revoked uh, uh the pro access and now you see an option to upgrade and uh, so let's say like i wanted to uh, uh, try let's ask some question now so let's say like what's your take on uh, robotics industry in 2030 so now uh, we shouldn't uh, be allowed to proceed with the query because I've reached more than 100 queries per day so I have that stats I'll, I'll just showcase in a while so when I uh, try to ask so this is what we showcase so just the message uh, limited so we have exceeded the message limit for this month and uh, so if you wanted to exceed that message limit per month so then the next option is to add in a usage based pride, uh, pricing feature to this platform so which um, um, will be added eventually but whatever is needed uh, the metrics so basically how much uh, 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 the user is using her platform so basically model wise the cost wise per model all of those metrics we are keeping track of so for example uh, let's say you wanted to know so all that usage based metric uh, system uh, that we need uh, so that it will be totally flexible for us to either go uh, in a uh, or subscription way or usage way so that system is in place so as of now i just added a subscription base eventually uh, we will add on top of that uh, usage based as well so that matrix for example all of that uh, so here uh, just um, uh, storing uh, based upon this user user organization and then so the tokens the prompt tokens completion tokens overall tokens how much it did cost so basically each query of the user how much did it cost for us in cents and for which model it costed us and the provider of that and all so we are keeping track of that and also i have just added an ai gateway uh, for all of the models so basically how many calls are being made to particular provider particular model and all those things so just single gateway so that we will have total control of the rate limiting and all those things so just an additional layer of measure or uh, security so uh, for us to control uh, to watch so now since uh, i am not able to go further and converse so let's try to upgrade this so uh, so you can either go for monthly or annually so since uh, it's uh, testing now so you know it's just uh, going to take us to the uh, the payment section and then you just go ahead and uh, if you would like to be part of this 
uh, Open Studio Chatterb ecosystem. So let's uh, now see how this is going to work. So just the test card here, and I'm just adding in some sample data. So let's just select. All right. Uh, so now once we uh, process this, so uh, so it's just going to process that, and we will be listening to the web hook events on the Linux PC. So based upon the event uh, that we are receiving, so it's is it a subscription event or order event, and all those like we have based on the docs that they have provided. So we'll be listening onto their web hooks. So once we receive that data, all we do is we'll just store it in one of our uh, table basically that order id and the tire that a user has chosen and all those things so when is it uh, his next uh, renewal is going to be in all those that so that we'll know whether the user is a premium user or free tire user and all so accordingly we can just grant an access to premium features on our platform so uh, now uh, it's done so let's uh, try going back uh, to this uh, thing so uh, uh, basically that button is uh, the continue uh, clicking on that it's going to redirect to the platform now you can see now uh, it before it was upgrade to pro now it is current plan so now I am pro user here so uh, so you can see here uh, it is changed to that so now let's uh, try to uh, shoot uh, the question So of course, uh, this bit of latency issue, uh, like I said, it's not there yet. So you can see now, uh, just um, basically just uh, I have uh, enabled this multi-assessment mode for, to just get the uh, feel of how this is going to be. Uh, so it is just typing for grok beast model in the, the sonar reasoning pro um, it should uh, also start generating content for us let's just try this let's wait for this all right um, so so since uh, there are a lot of things running on my uh, system so it's a bit little bit slow uh, and also of course uh, uh, the code wise also needs some improvement and uh, so uh, okay uh, now we are done so uh, that uh, typing generation and all you will be able to see that but uh, uh, I'm not sure now because there are a lot of things running on my system so this is what the response from this GOP's latest model and then this uh, reasoning basically these are like distilled model uh, so distilled model is nothing but uh, just training on the output of the large LLM models which are damn good at what they have trained at so rather than uh, training on the whole internet data uh, train on the uh, responses of the good uh, large language models and then make a new model of that uh, uh, responses itself and that's what uh, the deep seek and all those things a lot of techniques uh, uh, thing so this is now you can see um, I'm able to go and uh, start querying again because the limit of uh, the provisor is way higher and uh, uh, that's the thing that's added and also like all of this tracking in videos and click house in postgres db and all everything is there so complete flexible uh, it's going to be a lot of things so i'm just working on uh, the deep research now and also uh, and uh, so and additionally so since the data is lying in our uh, db's of usage and also I just need to add it to one of the components so that uh, user will have a good user experience of like how many messages are left uh, uh, for this month and other uh, stats if the user needs like model wise how many queries he has made 
or something like that uh, i mean that's also in pipeline so just a lot of uh, things uh, going on so just trying to work it out on a few things so this is what uh, the uh, the status of open studios uh, chat up and uh, more things will be in route and uh, yeah i hope uh, if you guys uh, and uh, one more thing is uh, i really uh, value your uh, feedback any box or any issues just feel free to uh, uh, dm or uh, comment um, or just you can open an issue on this uh, github repo so which is completely open all of these things that we are developing so so basically i'll be very happy uh, to fix that so that you'll have good experience on this platform yeah that's all i have for this video so let's catch you sooner